when you started med school, you had said to me what surprised you about your class at Zucker were how many people came from really competitive schools. And I think that we work with so many students coming, you know, you went to an Ivy League institution for undergrad. We work with so many students coming out of those schools that had this mentality. I have to go to an Ivy League medical school. I have to go to a Columbia and a Harvard and Yale. You really don't. <laughs> it's what you make of the experience, right? Yeah. I would say kind of overall, in terms of picking a medical school, right? Because, you know, it's right. It's, I mean, you're from an Ivy League institution. You want to go to one of these high powered institutions. To me, you know, what matters more is really the health system, I think. And kind of based on what you want to do as well, you know, if you know, I mean, a lot of people don't know the health system for me, kind of as we touched on a little bit before that our neurosurgery department is so strong that I felt like I had such a good base and I had such good mentorship for me. I mean, I wouldn't be here without them. Now it's different because there's a lot of institutions that don't have a neurosurgery department, for example. And so, you know, I don't, I wouldn't have been as successful if I went to one of those institutions. That's really what I've kind of taken away from my experience is when choosing a medical school, it's really more about the health system and really it is what you make of it. Kind of like you said, yeah. the opportunities are there you just have to go for it. And if you can do it, you're going to stand out.